And we start with Utah sending help to another state battling out of control wildfires. This latest group of Utah wildfires now, or these firefighters, on their way to Montana. ABC 4's Jared Giattini was there as they deployed this morning from the Maverick Center. 24 firefighters from several different agencies left this morning. They'll be heading to Montana to help crews there fight wildfires. Typical this time of year, although it may be a little bit sooner this year than previous years. Brian Case is among the 24 firefighters deploying. This new group will drive to Billings, Montana, where they plan to stay for 16 days. We've got what are called type 6 engines. They carry a little bit of water, a lot of hand tools. Um, the, 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 the real value is in the personnel here. They come with a lot of different qualifications and capabilities, so that's why we're being requested by the state of Montana. Fire officials in Montana say as of July 21st, there are 19 wild Fires burning throughout the state. It's a lot of fires uh, due to the dry materials. More than 1,500 fires have sparked since January 1st, 500 in July alone. More than 200,000 total acres have burned. Tie in with local resources and, and work on putting out fires. Crews in Montana struggling to keep up. Under a state to state mutual aid program, Montana has accepted Utah's help. The state already has two separate crews helping in Oregon. Sending resources to Montana, is that going to impact our response to any fires locally? Well, it's important to note that we obviously, you know, if, if we're not whole here in the state of Utah, uh, we wouldn't be able to, to send resources there. These men take pride in their ability to help a state in need. It's, I guess, the right thing to do. You know, you could say that. For some firefighters, this is their fourth deployment this year. The most recent, July 18th, they were sent to Redmond, Oregon. Jared Jotinini, ABC 4 News.